Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with more Spyro, a hero's tale. In the last episode, we made it here to the Sunken Ruins, and I kind of want to check out what this is. I'm pretty sure it's just to backtrack to where we had fallen down, but I did miss stuff up here, and considering there's invincibility, I thought it would be kind of cool to check it out, because clearly the invincibility is used for this over here. But, I don't think we can actually wall jump. You need the wall kick until you've acquired the ability from one of the elders. So, yeah. That's another ability we can't quite do yet. And that's kind of concerning because we still have so much to do, including Cloudy Domain. But the ability that we got at Cloudy Domain only helps in Cloudy Domain? Like, unless there's an elder in the sunken ruins of Bruhahaskiville, I don't know. We got something down here to look up at, or look up at, look at. Anyways, we got this. Light gem me, please. Nope, swirly egg. And uh, we do have three and three, so we're almost halfway done all the stuff here. Wow, we almost have all the concept, uh, eggs. Uh oh. This is weirdly mesmerizing. And also, oddly not very difficult. Just a free egg and light gem for literally doing nothing but gliding. Two collectibles in less than two minutes. Wow, game. That is a new record. And this probably just brings me back over because laziness, right? Oh, no! Never mind! This actually brought us somewhere totally new. That's not something that you'd expect. Also, what the heck is... Oh, it's an elevator. Why would there be an elevator? It just brings me down lower. Maybe this is where one of the Dark Gems is? Dark Gems are? Is? Isn't? This is a really weird open room with not a lot going on in it. Well, let's collect a lot of these gems first, because if we die, well, we all know that we're going to go way back to the last Zoe, and we don't know where that Zoe is, because this game is really bad for giving you checkpoints. Sure, it doesn't have lives, but the backtracking you have to do because of the checkpoint system is just horrendous. We got all this stuff over here. And look at that! We're almost at 10,000 gems again. Now, how much do you want to bet that we gotta go in here and... Oh, it's a light gem. Okay. Alright, we made it over to a different side now. Sweet, free light gem, I'll take it. Oh, it's all the same area, I think it just connected, and what is this? There's clearly stuff on the other side of it. How do we get there then? I'm so confused. One of these rooms has to connect a different way, right? There's like some kind of like water trough tunnel thing there. Maybe this has something to do with it? No? Sparks, can you go through there? Oh, there's an upper section, okay. Maybe it was just a platforming section. I thought this level had the pole vaulting thing here. Maybe not. Yeah, we can still... Why didn't you double jump? Like, I swear the double jumping in this game is really weird. Oh, I was right about the pole vaulting, by the way. Yayit! Yayit! Alright. Oh, that's the dark gem up there. And we'll grow some poles here. Wait, did that not create the poles over here? I'm so confused. Where'd they go? Over there, maybe? Where'd they go? Yeah, because there's nothing there. I'm so confused where they went.
Oh wait, do I have to glide over there? Maybe I have to glide over there. I don't know if I technically can, but... Oh, I can. Alright. But why would I be over here? There's no reason to be here. So, maybe I have to go back? Through... I'm an idiot. I forgot to grab the invincibility. That, that was on me. And yeah, where the heck are we? Oh, bro, we're not even that close to where we wanted to be. Now, we've already been up there. Like, we've already 100%... We still have to go up there, because we have to actually get to the uh, platform. That's kind of dumb that this place not only has two collectibles, but they're, like, mandatory to do. Because we need to get to the platform over here that apparently can't see off screen, which is funny. Or not off screen from a distance, but you know what I mean. Because so we need to actually go over here, which annoys me because. There's no checkpoint here. Also, why do I really want this elevator? Like, I don't want it right now. Go ahead. Hmm. Get up there. Thank you, Spyro the Dragonic Fool. Yeah, I think we brought out these ones. Woohoo! And a firework! Wow, and then that opened up those ones. But is there like a way across here that I can technically take? Because I feel like there's stuff on both sides that you just can't get and it's annoying me. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting that's not a control scheme in this. Hmm. Like, how am I supposed to get those? I can go through here though. Oh, no, never mind. Do we actually have to physically go through the acid? You actually do have to go through the acid for a dark gem. This is... This is just, uh, brutal. Also, this really isn't much of a challenge, honestly. Compared to the whole friggin' other things that we gotta do here, that's... It's actually not bad. I don't mind that one. I still don't know what's behind all that um, debris, though. I hate people who call debris Debris. It's like, it's not a person. Not This isn't Debra's weird cousin or something. This is like ruins of things, man. Let's um, take out all of these mini crystals. I'm going to call these ones crystals and the big ones gems. I still love the sound effect of them. And there's the second crystal one. Oh, it's gonna open up the door. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, those fishmen don't have nipples, but they have candles. Wait a minute, but if that opened up that, what's this? Yeah, what is this place? Oh, it's the firework! Yeah. Which, in turn... Oh. Please be what I hope you are. Please be what I hope you are. Come on, come on, come on. Darn it. That's two swirly eggs in the same level. That's not what I needed. At least now I can get the... Oh, hang on a second. Almost didn't make it over here. Let's say, let's grab those dark gems down there. Or dark shards, I guess. I don't know what I'm going to keep calling these things. But... It's actually kind of a cool little gimmick to have it backtrack like that. Now, where was the uh, exit? On the other side, because I'm an idiot. 
And this game just really likes making you do the exact same thing over and over and expecting different results. Like, you will get the same, you will get different results, but it feels like you're just literally doing the exact same thing, because that is not difficult, not in the slightest. It has yet to cause an issue. Oh, really? As soon as my invincibility wears off, you throw a starfish shuriken at me? So there's not very much of the level left to explore, yet we still have three gems and only two eggs. And then one dark gem, obviously, but... I still don't exactly know what we're supposed to do in Cloudy Domain, so... Either we're gonna have to backtrack and go and find some stuff or something, because... I don't know. Alright, Toxic Rise. I don't like that. That sounds terrible. Oh yeah, this. Huh. I can make that, by the way. And I tried recording um, Ratchet and Clank Size Matters for the channel, but it had issues where, like, what would happen is when I'd be moving forward, right, it would just kind of stick. And it would cause so many issues, and I couldn't move very much, so that's why I stopped. Ooh, a light gem. We're only two away. We only need two more, and we're golden. Two more. And we know where one is because of, um, of, 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 we've seen it. That, that's, that's what I'm looking for. Let's destroy things. Yes. More gems. Gems for the Horde. I guess it makes sense that Spyro collects gems because he's a dragon, right? Or is that racist? I don't know what this does. Oh no, pole vaulting. I don't like pole vaulting. Also, why did this raise up so high? Like, why is it the exact same thing? Oh yeah, this is this isn't like what you think it is. I don't actually know what those do either. We're raising up a statue which has the last dark gem. I thought this was like one of those things where like poison rises up and tries to kill you, but thank god I was wrong on that one. And why did I miss that? That actually looks like it was, like, way less deep than it was. Oh, I think you're supposed to take this because it gives you the height that you need to get to them. Yeah, see? Oh! That just moves the poles! I didn't even notice that. That's actually super useful. And then we can break this one, and then we only have... Break this one, press this one, we only have that one over there. Oh look, his head's sticking out of the water. Is that water or acid? It says toxic rise, so I don't know if it's water or acid, but... It's some kind of green insta-kill substance. And I'd prefer not to be part of it. And this should be the last one. Let's go. Boom. Rise. Now, we need to do this to break the door, and hopefully that brings us to the last gem. I don't really care about the eggs, because the eggs really aren't that mandatory for progressing, but gems are. Yeah, we still need two dark gems in the cloudy domain, or cloud domain, or whatever the frig it's called, the domain place. And that's crazy, considering that we literally got stuck and had nowhere to go. Oh, you're just one of these guys. Okay. Okay. Am I supposed to be scared of you? Where does this lead? To a room that we haven't been to yet with a few crabs. Why do the crabs sound so weird when you kill them, though? They don't sound like crabs. Dude, I jumped, and the game was just like, nah, you did not jump against that guy, sorry. Try again next time. 
Epic, my god. Ooh, more goodies. Boom. Boom. Is this just worth goodies? Because that's kind of lame, honestly. Or is it? Ah, uh, suspicious. Aha! I smell you later, Vader. All oh, with a chest. Probably a lightest of gems. That is what I'm talking about. A lightest of gems. Noise. Now if we could figure out how to get that light gem from that last level, then we'd be golden. But, I don't know, man. I don't know how to get it. So, I think what we're going to do... Right? Yeah, since it looks like we're done, everything else... Oh no, there's still one light gem. I don't actually know. But, what we're going to do... Atlantean entryway. We're gonna do this, and then we're going to go to the waterfall walkway. What we're going to do is we're going to go and go back to the first row and get the gem. And we do have health. Sorry, I was just having a drink. I should have filled up my cup though more before recording. Because I do not have enough. Okay, so we need to go back this way. Back this way? Not back that way. Um... Ah, there you are, my favorite one. Okay, so I can go to the depot by doing this, but I couldn't go to it when I used the other one. Okay, that's exactly what I wanted, because to go back to the other worlds, we need to go on to the big warp pad. And we gotta see if we're missing anything in, like, level 1 or something. And we're only missing one light gem here. We have the Dragon Kingdom, which... But actually... I love how this says Lost Cities, yet... Like, whatever. Anyways, let's go. We're gonna see if we can get... Something here. Because we just need one thing. So we have everything here. We Missing three here, though. Oh, yeah. Wasn't there a door here? Or was there? I actually don't know, but we should be able to get one of those. There's no way that all three of them are technically in the Crocoville Swamp. Like, let's be real. Um, Let's take this and go to... Oh, yeah. Crocoville Swamp. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll go here for right now. Because there's no way there's three bombs. Okay, one of them is probably going to be the supercharge. One of them is definitely going to be the door, if there was a door. Like, I don't even know, remember if this was a door, because... I don't think there's a door per world. I think it's just... Or, uh, per level. I think it's per world, not, not level. Hazards, yes. Um... Frig, I went the wrong way. This isn't where I want to go. One thing I do... Oh my god. Wait, I didn't actually take damage. I think I just hit the wall, right? Yeah, that was just the wall hit. Same sound effect and everything. You know, we want to go this way. I can actually charge into these guys to kill them. Just... I think they die slower, do they? No, never mind. Same death animation. No, this isn't the right way either. Oh, wait! It was the electric breath! Never mind, never mind, never mind. No, no, no. I know exactly what this was. We just didn't have the right breath type, but now we do. Yeah, we needed this. There we go. Like, super perfect. Enemies. Ow, boomeranged. What do we got going on over here, exactly? Like, what is this place? This is... Oh, it's an egg. 
This isn't a, at all what I was hoping for, game. Egg thieves are crafty. Yeah, I know. I've already seen one. Why are you telling me this for the very first time? Also, that is not at all what I was expecting here. Wasn't that like the last... There's only one egg left. And yet, we're still missing three light gems, and that's what the game gives us, is the freaking... I'm kind of itchy. Hang on a second. Ugh. I was hoping to get Cloudy Domain done in this level, t or this episode too, but I guess I'll have to wait till another one, because we're not seeming to find what we need in here. Like, this level is just really weird, because, like, there's all this excess stuff for no reason at all. It's just a big, empty, open area. This game is really weird with making, like, bonus areas look extremely odd. Which is perfectly fine, but it still looks just weird. And these spike hazards are just annoying because they just get tedious to avoid every single time you play. Wait, did we... I don't think we went up there. I just straight up think we completely ignored this. Yayit. Yayit. This does look like something I would have just straight up ignored by accident. Are you seriously kidding me? A random rock that I did not know would spawn spawns in, forcing us to have to spawn backwards and do things again? This game, man. Like, I swear to god. This game, while not having a live system, which thank god it doesn't because it would be brutally painful, it's so unforgiving, like, like, how are you going to know that there's going to be a falling rock right there? Like, it's not even technically on your screen either, it's kind of just there. Like, and they fall in the most awkward of spots. Wait, there's an egg. Huh. Wait, are you telling me this is the final egg? And not anything other than a final egg? Oh, that creaking sound effect. I technically don't know how to get... Oh, never mind. But are you telling me that we did this for the final egg and there's still three light gems somewhere in this level? My lordy game. I'm not appreciating this very much. And we already did Fredneck the Frog. And I think we already did the... Yeah, we already did the Light Gem there and that chest up there. And so where else is there to go in here? There's... You cannot tell me that the Supercharge is worth three Light Gems in a level. That is... A little too much for one level to contain. Hey Spyro, hey Spyro, you didn't spend a single thing yet, even though uh, you don't need anything. Please come spend it at my shop, man, because I need you to spend all that moolah. Hmm, nothing here it looks like, which is kind of disappointing. Go ahead, Spyro. If you've got money to spend, I am here to yeah, actually, I'll use you to teleport. Thank you. And we'll go back here, because there's such a big, unexplored area in the back of that. So hopefully there's a light gem over there, because I'm kind of concerned. Like, we're not finding any light gems. We also don't know how to break... Oh, no, that was supercharged. Dude, seriously? Seriously. What kind of nonsensical BS was that? I have played this game so much that the controls now... Oh my god, I'm an idiot. There, I forgot about this crack here. Oh, fire orb. Alright, this has got to be a light gem or gems. We did it! We did it! Yo, 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 yeet, yo, yeet, yo, yeet, steam, yo, yeet, yo, yeet, yo, yeet. Yee, dee, 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 d
Wait, did I end up backwards? I did end up backwards. I went through the tunnel and it ended up out the other way. Zoe in this game is in the most awkward spots too. It's not like she's just there. Oh. Oh. Now let me activate the super. Okay, or not. Here we go, Spyro. The supercharged gadget is now available. Okay, this is just weird. Because it doesn't function at all like you would think. It's not really supercharged. It's like... You can break stuff now with your head kind of charge. You know, and it's not very... Like, it's useful, but it's just kind of weird. Like, it's increased speed, kind of. But the meter goes down so fast that it doesn't really do anything. So anyways, I guess that'll do it for this episode. And in the next episode, I will meet you guys back at Cloud Domain, Cloudy Domain there to actually finish it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.